All right, guys, what's up? It's Saturday morning. Well, not really morning anymore. It's about two o'clock, but I'm out on my way to the lake. Um, Tyler's already out there. I'm gonna meet up with him. But I got my kayak in the bag, as you can see. Um, it's pretty nice out. It's about 50 degrees today, and a little sunny, a little bit of clouds, and there's the lake right there. Tyler's way on the other side, drunk diving too. But um, be out there in a couple minutes, and uh, I guess Tyler's caught a couple already, so we'll see what we can get. Out here, so um, right now I'm throwing this uh, striped king red eye shad. Fish on guys. First fish. Can't tell yet. What? I don't know yet. It's Pac. First fish guys, and it's a pike. Look at this thing. Oh, it's bleeding a little bit. I'm gonna the players. First fish. Caught on that, uh, Red Eye Shad, Lupo Strength Bait, from Strike King. I'll go ahead and get a video up on my phone just in case that didn't work very well. Alright guys, first fish. It's a little pike. I'm gonna go ahead and let him go. And he's gone. That was fast. Caught him on um, Red Eye Shad, Lupo Strength Bait, by Strike King. Like I've been catching all these fish on. But um, Tyler is right over there. And I just got over here, so um, I don't know, I was hoping that it was small because we're on like a sand flat right now. There's a little bit of weeds where that pike was, but um, hopefully we can get some more fish for you guys. I'm hoping to catch a smallie, so get back to you guys when we do. Hey guys, second fish. Yeah, I'm, I have a small one right now. Yeah. Nice bass. Kind of small. Kind of on that same metal trip. I'm gonna try to get a video of my phone every time now, just to, just so I know I got a good video. All right, guys, just got my second fish. Not five minutes after that pike. He's really fat for how small he is. Probably close to two pounds, even though he'd probably be under a pound in the summer. Nice little bass. Oh, jeez. Go ahead and let him go. There he goes. Caught him on um, same rattle trap or uh, whipless crankbait. Tyler's over there where I caught that big bass yesterday. <laughs> I don't think he knew that's where it was though. But um, right now I'm just yo-yoing that uh, whipless crankbait above the weeds, and looks like it's producing. So I'm gonna stick with this for a little bit. All right, guys. Tyler's got this nice brown bass. <laughs> Captain brown bass. <laughs> Where'd you catch one? I got him on that same red rail trap that you've been catching him on. I pitched it right on the, a line between that point right there, and he freaking whacked it. I could tell it was different because yeah. of how it was fighting, but I wasn't sure what it was. But nice small right there. First one of the year for me. There's a nice, there's like a big point that comes out here that's really shallow. I'm not over it right now. But... We'll look at it. It's a nice one. Two Forget colors on him. Yeah. Should get underwater leaf. Underwater leaves. That's a nice one Jeff just got. This was probably, what, three minutes after I caught that smallie? Yeah, right after. He got it in the same exact spot. Oh my gosh, guys, and let that go real quick. It's a nice one. Okay, so it was close to the boat. We couldn't tell if it was a smallie or largey, and then all of a sudden it took the rod tip and just took it completely under the boat. I thought he was doing it just to, it was pretty cool. Got it on the same rattle trap. We're both using the same one. Let me give him a close up of it. Right there. 
Nice fish. We'll get back to you with some more. All right, guys, just got another bass. Kind of on that tube. Look how badly he got there. <laughs> how deep he took that tube. Here, I'll try to focus in. He's, it's way back there. He's nice and right, large now. Yeah, there we go. He's a nice one. Probably close to three and a half pounds. That's a small one. Yeah, we thought it was a small mouth. It fought hard. Oh, so, dude, it's, it's swallowing it. Do you have any more of these red tubes? Yeah. I'm going to have to rip this one to get it out. He's swallowing it. So this is the third bass I've ever caught in a tube. Oh, I got it. That's another pig. Here, switch me. I'm going to... Here, I'll just... Get this nice one. Yeah. Nice bass right there. I'm going to say it close to like... I'm gonna say three four. Three, I'm gonna three, say three seven. Oh. Let's see. Okay, hook him up. Hold him up on the water. He's still not on the water. <laughs> oh, what is three it? three. That's close. I don't know how well the camera can see that. It's just hard holding it like that. Okay, grab it. Jeez, dude. I thought he was bigger than that. Okay, come on. Oh, hold him we up. gotta get some pictures. Hold him up one more time. Nice bass right there. Okay, we're gonna get some pictures and we'll get back to you with the release. Okay, everyone, here goes the release. Slobs for days. Look at how fat he is around. Stay tuned for more fish. All right, guys. So it's been a while. I finally got another bass. It's, it's brown. Mouth, yeah. It's brown fish. He lost a nice one. I think it was a smallmouth, like right over there in the shore over there. I don't know. Cut him on that red eye shad with those king bait. Oh! There he goes. <laughs> um, we're on like the opposite side of the lake right now. Oh! My Dobbins. <laughs> so hopefully we can get back to you guys with some fish. All right, guys. Got another oh! smallmouth. No! No! Nice little one. Yeah, no! Oh, he's freaking out about. Wait, don't let it go. But no! I don't want a picture, it's fine. That thing's huge! Oh my god, you just ripped the breeze bass. No! <laughs> Got him on this tube right here. Fish it, there's that um, boathouse right Man, there. Fish it back there and got him. What the heck? But, um, look back, you guys, just one fish. Alright, guys, I just got another bass. Um, so on that lipless crate bait, it's getting kind of later, so I'm going down. Nice little fat bass, probably just over a pound. But um, yeah, come on that same lipless crank bait. Um, it's probably been about 10 minutes, it's probably about 10 minutes, close to 15 minutes after I caught that smallmouth. But we're headed over to a canal right now, so we'll see how we do in there, but um, I don't know if you can see, but way over there in the background let it focus in way over there is where we have to kayak it back to to, get to leave so it's gonna be a long haul